Hello. In this lab, I'll show you how to do changes to Azure DevOps pipeline, and I'll also show you how to basically publish your build artifacts to either do some sort of storage or within the pipeline there is something known as a storage container so that those artifacts can be used later by you for deploying it on some servers so in one of the previous lab we saw how to set up an asp.net application now that application was getting built but it was not getting saved anyway now we want to save that application for storage so for that i'll do some modification to this pipeline I'll click on edit pipeline over here I'll write an step again you don't need to write this YML file you just need to simply search for the task which you want to perform this time I want to basically publish this artifact as you can see when you type publish you'll see various publish related jobs so I want to publish this artifact okay to a drop location within the Azure pipeline. So you have two options, either you save it in Azure pipeline storage itself or you can upload it to a file share path. I'll keep it inside Azure pipeline storage itself. Okay. And if you want, you can even uh, archive this or compress this by creating a tar. I don't want that. I'll just say add the job and it will add the task over. And this task will basically save my build article. Let's save this uh, Azure pipeline. YML file and once you save it, it would be committed inside Azure repo and as we have a trigger Whenever there is a commit in master branch, it should also run the pipeline. Let's click on save And as soon as you save it, it will also start the figure and figure will start the execution of my job. Job will have multiple task stages. It will basically run those stages and any task within those stages. So let's wait for this build job to get completed. So the build is completed and one of the tasks which got executed is the publish the build artifact. Right and it's published the build artifact to some location inside uh, the Azure pipeline as a one the first run inside a location known as a so where do I see this build artifact back if I click on this I'll see my build artifact necessary files this is a zip file which should be deployed on our server this is the application run the app so this is how you add a build uh, artifact publish location will basically save our build artifacts inside Azure pipeline. This is it for this tab. 